Okay, we're just starting this thing off right now. I've fucked up this challenge several times. I'm not gonna lie to you. You know why I screwed up so many times? Because the challenge is... I'm stuck in a hole. Are you serious? Oh! Oh, don't give me this! I'll just restart the challenge. The object of this this challenge is to um, get as few points as possible with seven burgers. You can't score more than 3,000 points. So, that that's actually proving to be pretty difficult for me since I am so incredibly awesome. Look at that. Just knocked down a whole cement pillar by being so regal and majestic. Oh, look at this guy. He doesn't even know what's about to hit him. Look at that. Look at that. Here's your crappy cheeseburger. I hope you choke on it. It's not a cheeseburger. It's onion rings. What am I saying? So, I gotta get as little points as possible. That means handing out onion rings to people that are pretty not hungry and also not getting any combos doing crappy flourish moves I okay, only get 300 points here's your crappy onion rings I hope, I hope they taste like crap <laughs> hey, look at this girl she's barely even hungry she's probably not even gonna eat these right now she's probably just gonna give them to the homeless guy outside of the construction site but too bad because of my magical crappy flourish moves I also made those onion rings taste like crap too hey here you go here's some crappy onion rings hope your house burns down look at this guy he doesn't know what's oh he saw me woe is me sometimes I get so angry I just wanna punch a giant cement cylinder because I can Oh, this guy's about to get a mouthful of cheeseburger. That's for sure. Look at that. Once again, I keep forgetting that I'm handing out onion rings and not cheeseburgers. Alright, only way to... I found this out. You can, <laughs> the only way to get up there is by punching out this cement cylinder. But apparently the king, obviously. I mean, he's the king, so... He has to have superhuman strength. That's just a given. That's just straight up fact, people. You don't get in a fight with the Burger King and live to tell about it. Burger King freaking destroys you. Here are your terrible onion rings. They're not made out of onions. They're actually made out of radishes. I mashed them up in a blender and shaped it in a circle. There you go. <laughs> Have some radish circles. And I actually did this really well this time, so I got 1300 points to spare. And if luck serves me well, I won't, you know, screw up completely horribly. Uh, this guy, I got your number right here. I'm heading for you. You're not gonna get away from me. Oh, he saw me. No! Everyone knows you just can't hand people hamburgers. You gotta. Did I call it a hamburger? I'm pretty sure I called it a hamburger. <laughs> oh, that'd be disgusting. You gotta be sneaky about it, folks. You gotta be sneaky. No one's gonna eat food from you if you don't sneak up and scare them first. Okay, that is the end of that challenge. Oh yeah, free roamer. I'm guessing that's because I unlocked the last zone. Which we are going to right now. And hopefully we get a wonderfully entertaining little newspaper story about my wonderful sneaking ex escapades. So we're going downtown. Be prepared to have your minds blown.
construction site was the unlikely setting yesterday for an impromptu visit from the king. A witness from the city noted that yesterday afternoon he was simply standing at the site when he received a polite tap on his shoulder. The witness turned around to find none other than His Royal Highness the King, offering him an Angus steak burger and an order of onion rings. No words were exchanged, but the King flashed a reassuring smile. Another worker reported that the King attempted to <laughs> That is not a reassuring smile! ...nearly 40 stories in the air. He later admitted that it was just a joke from the King, and that in the end, the two shared a robust laugh. Oh my gosh, he tried to kill him! He could have killed him! He tried to murder a construction worker. How do you... Burger King, why are you murdering us construction workers? That's not cool, dog. Murdering construction workers and shit. Oh, this place looks cool. Look at that nightclub. You know what would go great with your ecstasy, kids? Whopper Juniors. Okay, we gotta deliver four triple whoppers to people who go into shops. This looks strange. So... How do I know if you go into a shop? Looks like she will. Let's see how wonderful I am. Oh wow, look at my dance moves. Here's your freaking cheeseburger. Razzle dazzle. Very good. How are you gonna be so hungry if you just left the supermarket, dude? We got food there. Whoa! Got my karate moves. I'm gonna jump you and then give you a cheeseburger. I'm gonna beat you up, take all your money, give you a cheeseburger. Oh man, everyone is hungry coming out this supermarket. <laughs> I would not like to run into the king in a dark alley with those karate moves. Ah, who cares about my points? She doesn't look like she's going into any shops, so I'm not gonna risk it. And screw that guy. Alright, got this guy right around here. You know what you're gonna get? You're gonna get jumped by a karate ninja king of burgers and then get a triple whopper. There you go. Thank you. I have to say, I'm feeling a bit sad because this is the last level. That's a nice level. I'm waiting for the DLC to come out in this game, really. I got us I gotta hand out eight French fries. Yeah, I can handle it. Look at me, I'm a freaking marathon runner over here. You can't handle this. Yeah, I'm just going for speed, so I'm not gonna give them the razzle dazzle like I normally do. I gotta I'm on a mission, man. Gotta hand people some french fries. I should just throw it at them. Just start pegging people with boxes of french fries. That's what I'll do. I wonder if I can go in here. Get out here so I can give you french fries. Ass. Please don't faint inside of the laundromat. We'll have to hide your body in one of the washing machines. Look at me, I'm spinning around in circles, freaking blowing your mind. Razzle dazzle. I love the spirit fingers at the end. Oh, 
Oh, that lady's about to go into the subway. Let's jump her. Oh no, she got away! A construction guy. Oh, he saw me. This guy's hungry, though. Gotcha. Here's your fries. Eat up. They're good for you. They make you big and strong. This guy is dressed far too nicely to trust taking a handful of french fries from a stranger. I don't care how hungry you are, if you're in a suit that nice, it's not happening. What's up lady? I'm about to skip around and hand you some french fries. And then, spirit fingers. You, I'm gonna jump with my karate moves. And then give you french fries. <laughs> I swear, like, there need, there, there should, at this point, there should really be, like, a criminal investigation going on on this guy. Yes, he is giving people free food, but, like, all of his demeanor just screams crackhead. It's pretty bad. Whoop, that girl's down for the count. I wonder how many french fries I can hand out. I really just want to let the clock run out at this point, because... I mean, I'm, I'm pretty much the greatest sneaking ever. At this point. At this point in time, at this juncture, I am, without a doubt, the best sneaking player on YouTube, if not the world. And I'll accept, like I said before, I'll accept anyone's challenge. Because it's really not even a challenge, it's just a opportunity for me to prove how much better I am than they are. Not that that needs to be proven either. I wonder if I can steal these cars. That'd be so much better if I could just do drive-bys on people with french fries. Drive-bys with french fries. I could work that into a wrap. <laughs> I'm not gonna start freestyling right now, that's my gift to you guys. I'm gonna find out where this manhole goes. I could just pop out on other sides of town, that'd be cool. <laughs> like, honestly, I have a feeling that this guy isn't allowed within 300 feet of, like, elementary schools. Or playgrounds. Okay, that's good. Very good. I suppose we'll wrap off this episode right about now, and I hope you enjoyed it. Hopefully we can uh, wrap up a few of these missions. Figure just do um, half of the missions here, and then we'll uh, call it a day. Sounds pretty good. See you guys later. Bye-bye.